Hello and welcome to Shipping TV News on Friday the 21st of June 2019. We're starting a new series of short clips today and uh, essentially what we're doing is expanding our interest to cover shipping and other aspects of international and national logistics as we go along. So today for instance we're going to be having a brief look at the ferry trade into Harwich and Felixstowe. That's a thousand trailers inbound every day and we're also going to be looking at some drone technology in remoter parts of the world. And finally we're going to be aboard a ferry running between Southampton and the Isle of Wight where Madness sung a birthday song to the captain. Although at the present moment in the UK and in Europe we're all excited about Brexit and what interest that that will bring to us, one of the things that we don't recognise in the UK is how much shipping contributes to our lives. Some of our biggest ferry ports like Dover handle massive amounts of commercial traffic. Dover is reported to handle 10,000 commercial vehicles per day. But the combined efforts of smaller ports like Felixstowe and Harwich also handle a lot of freight. There are three freight ferries daily coming into Felixstowe and two dedicated freight ferries and two mixed passenger and freight ferries going into Harwich. It's an interesting combination and between the set of them it means that in this specific area of the UK we get around a thousand trailers full of imports every day. Now a lot of those trailers are chilled and a lot of them carry stuff that we eat. The fact is that when I did a trip on one of those ferries a few years ago we looked at the cargo manifest and you could have had a very nice dinner from what was on board. There were frozen steaks, there were frozen chips, there were all kinds of vegetables and there was also quite a lot of drink of one sort or another. There was some wine, there were some spirits and there was loads of orange juice. So we don't really realise how much food and drink comes to us from abroad on ships. Whenever we hear the word drone, we think about Amazon delivering our latest purchase with something like this. But drones come in other shapes and sizes too. Thinking outside the last mile parcel delivery scenario has led a Bulgarian startup company called Dronamix to design a cargo drone aircraft that looks more like a plane. This is a quarter-sized prototype, but the real thing will be able to carry up to 350 kilograms of cargo and fly up to 1,500 miles at twice the speed of a car or van using satellite navigation and advanced autopilots and flying to and from unpaved runways. Dronamic's Black Swan drone is aimed at places where infrastructure like road and rail are undeveloped, yet demand exists for same or next day delivery. The builders say that the payload capacity and space will make it ideal for carrying e-commerce deliveries, agricultural products like perishables and flowers, and medical supplies. Dronamics plan to start test operations in Europe and Africa in 2020. In each country they'll partner with a leading locally based airline to bring this as a domestic same day service over distances which may be impractical with other forms of delivery transport. Learn more about Dronamics and their Black Swan drone at their website at www.dronamics.com Com. If you've been aboard a ferry travelling from the uh, Isle of Wight back to Southampton some weeks ago, you might have noticed some famous people aboard. It was the Isle of Wight Festival and Madness were aboard one of the ferries. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Alice. Happy birthday to you. 
And that's the Shipping TV news for Friday the 21st of June 2019. I'm Chris and I'll be back with you soon. Don't forget to keep an eye on us online on YouTube, on Facebook and on Twitter and of course on our website at www.shippingtv.co.uk Take care now.